this is one of the best scalping strategy that i've come across okay using two indicators on trading view and i decide to share this with you even if you're a beginner this scalping strategy is very easy to understand and you can get up to 98 percent win rate using this indicator if you use it the way i'm going to teach you in this video so in this video i'm going to walk you step by step on how to set up these two indicators and how you can use it to get up to 98 percent win rate when it comes to scalping the crypto market the forex market or even the stock market all right so if you are new to the channel and you love videos about crypto trade and investing then consider subscribing hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published on this channel okay so if you want to learn more you can use the links in the video description to join my telegram group and these indicators are free to use okay in as much as you are using just within um it's just two indicators we are using so you can use it on a free trading view account if you don't have a trading view account already you can check the video description and sign up for one okay so to show you what is possible um we only take sell we take sell positions okay on the red zone and then we take um buy positions okay on the green zone so um for instance if we have taken this short position here when we got the signal here let's say we enter this trade somewhere here okay so if i bring this when we got the signal around here okay we'll put our stop loss somewhere around here okay um always put your stop loss in the previous either swing low or swing high okay depending on the position you're taking so um you just target here let's say we enter this market somewhere around there we just want our risk reward ratio to be 1.5 okay the risk reward ratio here should always be 1.5 because you are scalping you don't want to be greedy okay you want to leave the market as fast as possible even if you have made this okay increase this to even if it is 3.1 you would have still 3x okay your your profit all right you would have still make three times the amount of money you are risking all right you see that this trade would have been a, a winning trade okay this trade would have been a one trade all right so this would have been a one trade the same thing happens okay um when you are taking a long position remember you take short position in the red zone and then in the gray zone that is where you take your you know buy position so if i come in here and enter a trade here let's say when we got the signal we enter a trade here okay you would have target a 1.5 okay if i follow this trend for instance this would have been okay up to 2.1 or there about this scalping strategy with these two indicator work like magic okay we're just going to use two indicators um you can use this indicator alone but in order to um okay filter out first signal i do complement this with a 200 moving average okay so i'm going to show you how to set this up and how you can start using this trading view i'm going to show you where to find your entry okay where to set your stop loss your take profit and then at the end of the video towards the end of the video i'm going to equally going to give you a bonus to show you how to set up a lot using trading view all right so before we proceed just take a second and give this video a thumbs up okay give the video a like and leave a nice comment in the comment section below all right so here we are um before i actually started this video this is a trade i entered okay before i decided to come make this video and this trade actually hit its target all right this is why i decided to share this um strategy with you so i'll go ahead and you know remove all indicators then i'll add up the indicators okay so once you log into your trading view account the first thing you want to do is to come to the indicator tab all right and you want to type in here super i will quickly leave the um, indicator name in the uh, video description okay you want to come in here and type in super kubi super goopy super goopy all right and um you get a lot of super goopy but the one we are concerned with is this super goopy okay by just uncle all right this is the one you want so make sure that you add this to your favorite so that you don't get to look for it next time so you go ahead and you know add up this indicator into your chart okay so just click on it and that will be added into your chart all right this is how it is this indicator um if i go to the setting icon here all right you see here that this indicator is made up of a lot of moving average fast moving averages slow moving averages and many more okay and it has been working perfectly fine for me all right so in order to filter out um false signals okay i equally use another indicator which is the moving average so if i just come in here and type in em here okay i'll go ahead and plot this indicator into the chart 
and then when i when i add it up to the chart i want to come to the settings okay of this ema and change the length to 200 all right so i'll change the length to 200 and then the style i'll make this indicator um the line white and then i can make it thicker if you want then go ahead and click on okay so what we do is we are following the trend with this indicator all right if you're a trader you must make the trend your friend okay you must make the trend your friend so what we do is we are using the 200 moving average to filter out okay um false signals all right so whenever we get these candles okay the moving averages this um you know the super gooby indicator trading above the 200 moving average we're only going to be looking for a buy signal okay for a buy signal so at each interval all right once um the indicator notice a strong momentum in the market okay it gives you the signal you can see all right so there was a signal here all right and the crossover happened somewhere around here so after this you get another signal here you get another signal here so you can continue to write the trend all right you can continue to write this trend and follow suit all right the way the more you get this indicate the signals the more you take that okay so you can see here there is another signal here this is another good one if you have taken this this is another signal and it continues like that this is for a buy okay whenever you see the green zone you are going to be looking for only buy signals all right then to take a sell signal you do the exact opposite so for sell signals we want this indicator the super gooby indicator to be trading below the 200 moving average all right this should be trading in as much as this is trading below the 200 moving average we are only taking sell signals okay we are only taking sell signals all right even if you get a buy signal in as much as this indicator like this okay for instance i wouldn't have taken the, any of this signal okay even when the zone is a green zone i wouldn't have taken that signal all right so i use the 200 moving average to filter at false signals like this all right and only take you know the signals that are very clear so if you have followed this this would have been a lot of profit for you all right so the basic rules to using these indicators okay is whenever you want to take a sell or a short position okay make sure that the indicator the super gooby indicator is trading below the 200 moving average all right and then the moving averages here are all in red so whenever you see this um blue um signals appeared here okay and then the candle start changing from you know this gray to the blue and the rest and it continues like that it means that the market is beginning to change direction if it is in an upward trend it is beginning to change to a downward trend then if it is in a downward trend it is changing to um an upward trend okay so if you follow this once you come in here you see that okay from here it begins to change this is where the red ends so one thing i will advise here is you can always follow the trend until when you see this gray line start following it means that you need to be adjusting your stop loss and your take profit level to be able to do this okay you need to be dynamic in taking profit and um, setting up your take profit and stop loss so this started changing direction here okay it started changing direction and then we continued with the downward trend again so the red um zone now came in again so we continue with that downward trend and then here it changes again we now get got another blue here then from here we got the green signal okay and then in just a short while you see that it started changing okay the direction started changing and it started going up so this is just what you are looking for when the this moving averages indicator is trading above the 200 moving average you look for a buy signal and then when it is trading below the 200 moving average you look for a sell signal this is how i use the 200 moving average to you know always follow the trend okay at that particular time that i'm trading all right this is basically how you do that and you can use the, both the long and short position to to set up your take profit and your stop loss for instance if i bring in the long position two and then i enter this market okay when i got this signal i can ignore the signal let's say i took the next signal here which is here so if we have entered in this candle so we would have set our take profit below okay or just at the moving average and then i will bring this upwards here just targeting 1.5 all right targeting 1.5 so this becomes your take profit okay here becomes your entering price and then this becomes your stop loss this is what you are going to plot into your exchange whatever exchange you are using 
okay and then for you not to um, just stay here and stay at the market all day you need to set up a lot so to set up a lot i'm going to set the alert on this indicator okay the um, signal indicator which is the super Gubi. so all i need to do is to come in here all right this is your alert on trading view this um log icon here that is your likes a lot so go ahead and click on it and once you click on it you want to click on create a lot so i'll click on create a lot and then this dialog box pops up when the dialog box pops up it gives you option to set a lot you want to set it on the coin you're trading itself or on the move on on any of these indicators so i want to set it on the super gobi so i'll go ahead and select the super gobi okay then we want to set one alert for the buy arrow and then another one will be for the sell arrow okay so you can go ahead there are different parameters that you can use to set up this okay if you want to do for crossing and the rest okay we'll just do for buy arrow so i'll go ahead and do that for buy arrow and then we want to make it once per bar okay so once you make it once per bar you want to come in here and name it whatever you want to name all right and then you can type anything here okay maybe you can type buy a lot for instance okay you can type in here buy a lot for you know that particular indicator and the rest and after that you go ahead and click on create all right so once you do that you come in come back here again and create another one for a cell signal okay so we select the indicator and then we want to select a cell arrow all right so make sure it is once per buy again and then go ahead and check this and create that signal and whenever there is a signal you get is notified on the app all right if you have the trading view app already you get notified there then you get you know a pop-up if your system is still open if your trading view is still open on your system you get a pop-up with you know um a, with, with a tone all right with an alarm then you can equally get email notification all right so that is it and um, that way whenever you get the alert you come back here and take the trade remember this scalping strategy can be used for one minute okay scalping on the one minute time frame five minutes time frame you can equally use it for swing trading you can use it on a higher time frame and it works perfectly well that is all i have for you in this video if you do gain value from the video like the video and don't forget to leave a nice comment below and i'll see you guys in the next video